Allah says in Surah Al-Baqarah, in verse number 245, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Man dhal ladhi yuqridu Allah qardan hasana, fayudha'ifahu lahu adhaafan kathira. Who would give a loan, a loan to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? A loan, qardan hasana. And Allah will increase him many folds. A man by the name of Abu Dahdah, came to Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi and said, Ya Rasulullah, Allah needs loan from us. He, does, he needs a loan from us. He said, he does not need the loan from you because he is poor. He is taking this money from you and then he will exchange it to you in the akhirah with something that is far greater. That's what Allah means. He says, if that is the case, Ya Rasulullah, I have to gardens beautiful gardens huge gardens i give them to you ya rasulallah give me your hand i will shake your hand and both of them are yours fi sabilillah the prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi told him give us one and keep one for you and your family don't give everything that's also something important when you give give no problem but don't give in a way that you deprive your family as well given moderation, moderation. Take enough to live good, comfortably you and your family, and then the rest you can give. No problem. خلص. So he said, if that is the case, Ya Rasulullah, I will give you the better garden, the better one. It has 600 date trees, palm trees, 600 of them in this garden. It's yours, Ya Rasulullah. Fi sabilillah. Then he goes back to who? His wife, Abu Dahdah, goes back to his wife and he tells her, Today I made a great business deal. A business with Allah. She said, What did you do? He said, I gave this garden that you are in right now, this garden, I gave it to Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi, to give it to the Muslimin. His wife had collected some dates in her pocket and the pockets of her children from this garden. She said, well done, my husband, well done, well done. This is the business that you should do. She turned to her children, she said, take out the dates from your pockets. Now these dates belong to the Muslims, they don't belong to us anymore. So she took out the dates, kept them there, collected all the dates, and they left the garden to the next one, to the one that they have. The Prophet ﷺ said that Abu Dahdah has bought a beautiful place in Jannah for himself. That's what we need to do, to invest money for our akhirah. And you find an example of this is Khadija Salamullahi alayha. She did not have anything left anymore, even a kafan. She could not afford to buy a kafan anymore. This rich lady, this wealthy lady of Quraysh gave everything for the love of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi, and for the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala everything 